What is going on folks? Welcome back to another video. It's been too long since I've been um, fly fishing. Right here, I had a bunch going on. I had a spring break trip for a class where I was in Florida and then I had shooting, uh, clay target shooting nationals in San Antonio. Um, so I haven't been at school in like a month, which has been great, but I'm missing the fly fishing. And we're back now. Today is March 27th and it is feeling like spring, folks. I am so excited. I'm in a, sh I'm in a short sleeve shirt right now. The birds are chirping, the flowers are blooming, there's flowers going everywhere. And that means the fish are biting. But, whew, that gets me all excited. So, I heard a super small creek today. I've um, been here once before, and I caught fish in about every hole, but there was like only two or three holes. So, <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna fish that, and we're gonna explore a little bit too. There's some, I think there's some upper sections, um, and I need to scout for turkey hunting season as well. So, with that being said, we're gonna hit the river. I'll show you what we got going today. We have our. 7 foot 6 3 weight that we actually broke in the last video, but we got a new tip for. Um, and then we're starting off just a little Parachute Adams purple dry. They should be munching dries, knock on some wood. Um, um, so we'll switch up the dries, uh, but this is such a small creek that you kind of got to fish dries. So we'll see. Should be a great day. And at the very least, we're out here enjoying the freaking beautiful weather. That's all I care about. This feels so good to be out here. So let's get out there. Managed to botch every fish in the first hole, so that's a great start. There he is. Nice. Nice. That is a beauty right there, folks. That is a beauty and a half. How are these fish so perfect? Oh my gosh. Like I really don't get how. <laughs> Alright, the uh, camera's way up on the shore. And I really don't want to keep them out of the water for that long, so I'm just going to get you guys on my phone here. Look at that. How God did that, I'm not sure, but he sure did good. All right, and I let this guy go back to the abyss and get one gripping grin here. Makes a little boy very happy. So 10 minutes in, got a fish. We will take it. Keep moving upstream. We're going to attempt to get down there to fish. I don't see it going very well. There's only one way to find out whether or not it will go well. One just absolutely munched it, guys, and I missed him. Mm -hmm. ah, he munched it again, damn it. He munched it again. That is a toad back there, guys. Oh 
Oh my gosh. Why are my hook sets so bad, guys? That was freaking four in a row that I have absolutely botched. All right, folks, just walked a bunch. I found a really good spot. I didn't know I was here, but gonna make our way down this first. change um, yeah. all right folks we made a switch to an elk hair caddis um, great all-around fly and I, I've had good luck with before in my like, kind of wintery months um, so but <laughs> look what I just found right here you gotta watch where you step here Alright folks, pretty little rainbow here. Pretty little guy. Alrighty sir, we'll see you later. Oh baby, that feels good. It has been too long since I've caught a fish. All right, folks, a little update here. It is uh, about 3.15. So we've been going for, I don't know, two hours maybe? Um, sorry, the water's right here. I hope you can hear me, but doing pretty good. Um, I realized I only caught two fish. It feels like I've been doing a lot better than that. Um, had a lot of, a lot of missed fish, um, but this creek is really cool. It's opening up a lot more the higher you go, which is super cool. Um, so, that being said, made another little fly change. Went through a smaller elk hair canvas. Like, pretty tiny, and it's just white on the bottom. Um, I realized that last one, it was pretty poorly tied. And I also had a couple of fish come up and look at it. So I think it was a little bit too big, um, especially for this small water. So, we are going to try this guy and see what I see a good hole right there. So, we're going to see what he does. Well, <laughs> he was there, and then he was not. <laughs> oh, I had him. Oh, folks, I had that fish. He was, my fly kind of sunk. And I was picking it up and it just got tight and it hook never set and saw him turn over. That's a nice one too. Oh boy, folks, that was a lot of fun. That was pretty freaking cool. Thank God the fish started to sat there for a little bit and just thinking. I mean, I'm like a little poetic one, but just sitting here like, look at this. Look at this, guys. Pretty waterfall, sun shining through, a gorgeous freaking fish. Like, there's no way all this was on accident. There's no way this could have just appeared here by itself like god is so freaking cool this 
sitting there, just gorgeous day, sun shining through, like 60 degrees right now. And then when it gives you this, the fact that he gave us this to pursue and use, I think is pretty, it's pretty freaking cool. Anyways, enough of the rambling, but let's keep on fishing here. Alrighty folks, we are back at the truck as you can tell. It's about 5.30 right now. Um, I gotta head back, I got some school work to do. Um, gotta get dinner, but a good day I'd say. Sorry, I'm on, I'm on the phone. The big camera battery died. I gotta, that, that's on me. I gotta get some new batteries. I haven't done that yet, but it was a good day. Very good day. Um, definitely a discovery day for sure. I didn't know all that part of the creek existed. So that was a big shock to me and very, very helpful to know. Um, so I would definitely be coming back here for sure because this is an awesome creek. Um, I just couldn't quite figure them out today. I don't know if I was, I realized I was looking at my tippet. My tippet was pretty short and um, I don't know if I didn't have the right fly on, but it was still a good day. I had three in the net and missed 10 maybe. <laughs> I don't think your hookup ratio is supposed to be that bad, but mine was, but it was a good day. It was a really fun day. Um, yeah, and just great to be out springtime fishing again. I'm freaking pumped. So with that being said, I really appreciate you guys watching. If you made it this far, you're a real one. And with that, we will see y'all on the next one.